What's up, guys? LQ here to talk about Big Shot Season 2, Episodes 6, 7, 8, and 9. Uh, I have been doing individual episode reviews, but last night I went on a four-episode binge of Big Shot, and, uh, and that's because these four episodes, I, I really enjoyed them, and I just kind of kept the ball rolling when I was watching them. Um, this has been a clump of episodes that I, I, I've definitely very much enjoyed. I've got one episode left, the finale, and I'll probably be watching that tonight. Um, in this clump of episodes, I have loved seeing um, the relationship between Corn and Holly blossom into a romantic one. However, as is the case in these shows, there are, there are bumps in the road that could be avoided if they were simply effective communicators. Corn has turned into someone who all of a sudden does not want to share how he feels, and if he does, he lashes out irrationally. I felt like some of this was a little bit out of character for him. It did set up a nice arc where he visits his old coach who's in hospice care, and uh, and, he, and he's dying, and uh, his talk with his old coach um, leads him to a different perspective, um, which I definitely changed, definitely, especially, which I definitely enjoyed, um, especially a different perspective when it comes to Holly. Um, of course, Holly has obstacles also, including an ex-husband, but Corn and Emma moving in with Holly has created a nice dynamic in the show, including a bit of a role reversal that puts Holly in the driver's seat, which, like I said, it's created a very nice, different perspective for that relationship. Um, as for the basketball component of the show, you know, listen, there's, there's not a lot of realism here. Uh, most schools have rules that prohibit someone from joining halfway into the season, and it's happened twice now with Emma and the Australian girl. If the school doesn't have that rule, you know, a lot of conferences will still have that rule. And I think Corn is just very willy-nilly about who he wants on the team and who he's going to start. And I realize it's creating drama for the show, but it also takes me out of the realism of it a little bit. Ava's character development has been nice, seeing her go to prom, seeing her relationship with her mom. All that has been good as well, even if her and Luis becoming besties happen a little bit too quick uh but you know i can nitpick the show I, I, it has some issues but overall it's been enjoyable enough that i would recommend it and i'm definitely looking forward to the finale here and i'll probably watch it tonight so let me know what you guys thought of uh the back end of big shots in the comments below i would love to hear hear it so until next time see you guys later